well, top tips for athletes heading to Glasgow. Uh, the first one would really be be prepared. Uh, we, we generally would say in the, in the uh, Commonwealth Games or Olympics environment, be prepared to be resilient to whatever's going on because things that feel really great or are really exciting, they can be distracting in the same way as things that feel bad or, or anxiety producing as well. So, you know, having a family there to support you, well, that's great, but um, on the other hand, you know, the stress over uh, inevitable things like transport arrangements and where you're lodging in the village and all those sorts of things, well, they can just divert attention away from the main job in hand. So that's one thing is being able to keep that really clear focus on the job in hand no matter what's happening. Probably the other side would be just as a function of how the brain works is that all this background activity and interest and you know the other athletes walking around means that even if it's not stressing you out, it's still just pressure and background noise so that your general level of, of um, activity in your brain goes up so that a little event is more likely to send you over the edge than it would be in another environment. So I suppose it's in that environment to be more deliberate around keeping a clear mind, uh, keeping calm and, and uh, probably relaxed in the body away from competition as well, making sure that you're giving enough weight on your, your recovery and downtime so that when you do get to the added pressure of competition in that environment that things are less likely to trigger you. So you're just operating off a, a, a better and stronger foundation.